Hey guys, just here doing a quick tutorial video for people who are running a multi-monitor display and having issues with Tyranny being on the wrong monitor. So Tyranny itself does not have a option in the options menu where you can change what monitor it is, but it runs on Unity and Unity has an own bug where it likes to appear in the left monitor. Why? Because it's probably looking for the origin point which is 0, 0 which is always the top left coding blah 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 blah. So what you want to do is you want to go on to Tyranny if you've got, um, if you're running Steam then this is the easiest way to do it. You want to head to your properties in Tyranny, go to the local files, hit browse local files. I don't use, um, I don't use shortcuts or anything like that. I always use, uh, I always just use Steam because I don't like my desktop being cluttered. So if you're the same as me, do that. If not, then what you can do is you can right click on your, um, on your shortcut and there should be one, there should be an option that says open file location and that'll bring you to here. Then what you want to do is you want to hold in the shift key and double click on tyranny. And what it should do is bring up this tyranny configuration where you get to select which monitor you want it on. You can also select windowed mode, not windowed mode. You can select what qu graphics quality. Obviously there's a lot better options in the game so I would do that. This is probably the main reason that you want to use this is just to select if you want the left display or the right display. Hit play and the game should load up and it should be on the correct display. Ta-da! Perfect. Massive thank you to the, the Tyranny actual Twitter account for letting me know this because I was getting really hacked off with the fact that it kept popping up on my left monitor and then I had to, my workaround was to swap monitors then launch the game and then yeah, it was just a nightmare. But uh, yes, yeah, so hopefully that helped out any of you guys who are having the same issue. But as always, I've been Steve, you've been awesome and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.